And once again, as Frankenstein is revealed, we are venturing into Universal Studios Hollywood. Kind of a crazy day because it's like, it's like overcast. I didn't, when I looked at the forecast, I didn't say it was going to be like this. I actually said it was going to be in the 80s, but now it's only supposed to be high 70s at the most today. Pretty wild too, because this dark and gloomy feel is very ominous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> As you can see, the park is decorated for Halloween Horror Nights. And we have something special in store for today. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Fast Pass with us. I'm Jason. Hi, I'm Amber. And today we're here at Universal Studios Hollywood because we are going on a lights on tour for Stranger Things The uh, Maze for season four. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it kind of went all over the place, but we got there. So yeah, are you excited? I am excited. It's actually going to be pretty cool to see it. Good morning. morning. Thanks. Go oh, party. hi. That's <laughs> right, I'm a narcissist too. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we're, uh, we're going to check that out and that'll be, that'll be pretty cool. So we've never gotten to do this tour before and that'll be a fun new thing for us to experience. You ready? Let's, Let's go check, check it out. out. And they're in full swing for Halloween Horror Nights. All these props are still out there. <laughs> Our reservation is at two o'clock, so we're gonna try and kill some time beforehand. And I was just telling Amber, we haven't been on the Simpsons ride in a while, so we're gonna go, uh, go on the Simpsons ride. Well, we hadn't done that in a while. That was fun. I'm trying to find a picture. Yeah, we're trying to get our picture, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Hey, right on, Homer. How are you? Knuckles. Homer, we just went on your ride. Yeah, yeah, it was awesome. Yeah. We got really wet though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, it was still fun. We had a blast. You can, can I get a picture with you? Alright. Yeah! So we just met Homer, and since we were the first person to meet, meet him, him today, we got a button. And the only way to get it is to be the first See, we person. Have brought ours. So you could have given him one of ours. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. We decided to, uh, since there's no way, we're going to go on the uh, studio tour. Yep. So we'll go see how that looks first thing in the morning. <laughs> Honestly, so far there's like, I think the longest wait that I saw was 15 minutes for the Harry Potter. Harry ride. Potter, yeah. So, so far, so good. Yeah, having a great time. I'm hoping since it's, uh, what is today, Wednesday? Today's Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. It's Wednesday. Wednesday, school's in session. Hopefully, will be low wait times. Yeah. So this is Will. Holidays in Hell Maze. You always get to see the minions right there. Feels like we're usually it was going the other way, but we're going to the side of the set. Monster movie Girl, by Tristan Eats and we usually always go up there, so this is like a different point of view for it. Tough lady. This is my favorite hot dog guy. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Remember me? No. <laughs> Just like old times. Gotta love New York City. Hey! I'm walking here! So it's not exactly New York, but a lot of times when you see New York in the movies, it was shot right here on the Universal Metro sets. If you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. Even if you make it here on the Universal lot. And Rob York is where Jimmy Fallon got his start. It's also where the big eight came on. It is outside the end. We're going to hear now from the director of our 2005 retelling of the classic King Kong story. Here we go. We're about to enter Kong Skull Island.
Put the last car. Take the last car. Oh no! No 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 no! Oh! Oh! oh, oh missed us! Right on. I think it's gonna start raining. Oh whoa! Look at that! Look at this! A little bit of rain. part of the trip. There's a fit in the water. Oh no. Oh no. Decked out for Halloween Horror Nights, Universal City Department of Human Indigenous. Oh, there's soon somebody in there. That's Larry Larva's little little spot right there. So you can see they got all the construction out here, so you can't really see too much of the Bates Motel. Oh, there he is. He's so since the hotel has got the layover, it's pretty cool that he's over here at the house. And then during HHN, you can go get a picture taken with him over there in front of the house. And over here, they have a picture spot during HHN where you can get your picture taken with the Santa from Violent Night. And we decided. As a staple of all of our trips, we gotta get a butter beer. And I'm definitely gonna get that gluten-free one, because last time it was so good. Just love this land. Seriously though, have you seen this wizard? You can't see it right now because of the reflection. What is that? Doesn't get much better than this. You're not gonna cheers me? Cheers. Okay. The raw out of the vegan one, I had to get a regular one. It tastes the same. Hey Scoob! How you doing? Earlier the whole gang was out here, but you weren't here. I was like, I gotta wait until Scooby gets back so I can come see him. <laughs> okay, can I get a picture with you? Alright. Fast Pass fans, come on, give Amber some support. She wants her picture with Hello Kitty, but she's being like, like shy. Oh, he cut off the line! Ah. Oh. Yeah, that's lame. Oh no. Maybe not, hold on, I'm gonna ask. We made it just in time. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, here, let me get a picture for you guys. Okay, one, two, three. Thank you. Love your outfit. And we completely missed this when we walked in. Look, Chucky's Killer Barbecue. I feel. Oh. Let's come over here and see what they got, because we might have to come here for, for dinner. Oh my gosh! Look at all this. Look at all these spicy things. Look at that mac and. Oh no, that. That's a funnel cake. Oh, it's a funnel cake. But look, that's mac and cheese pulled look at pork that mac and cheese. with jalapenos on it, and then it looks like a spicy corn dog. Oh man. We might have to come here. So look, oh, these are actually like screen used. Yeah. That's pretty cool. He's <laughs> dressed up like Hannibal Lecter. Well, look, yeah, and they got the other ones over here. Chucky's really like the, uh, he's like the main guy for this year, huh? How yoked he is. I know. <laughs> That's a kind of a cool shirt, huh? Yeah. That one's pretty neat. Dude, this is awesome. This doesn't even have to do with HHN. This is just a cool Frankenstein hat. Oh, that's pretty cool. Holidays in Hell. No, we've been through that maze before. Have we? Oh, you haven't. I've been through that maze before. Is this before. a classic? Yeah, it, it was back in 2019. I went through that. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's for the new Exorcist. It's really cool looking. But actually, this is the stuff. I think I'm gonna get that. Look how awesome. It looks like a classic monster movie. And look, they even got it on glasses too. See, Larry Larva is an icon. It smells like pine. I only have one. Here, so do here. I. Here, you hold that. There we go. Okay, so it kind of smells like a citronella candle. Yeah. That makes sense. Bugs. Yeah, bugs, yeah. Bugs. I love it. Oh, you like all this? Was it like tarot? Oh my god, do you see that? Oh yeah. Oh my god. Look, headbands. It has pockets. And it's got pockets? Oh, see? Look, they even got sweat outfits. Is that a spirit jersey? Oh, it is. Oh, can you, are oh we able god, to see it? So we got shirts. So this is pretty cool. I like this hat. I'm actually currently wearing the uh, the one from last year. This one's pretty neat though. This actually, I have the Ghostbusters hat and it looks like it's made out of the same kind of material. I wear the Ghostbusters one very frequently. See, this is the one I currently have, which I, I really, really like this one. The colors and the way it looks and everything. Oh, so you, here's here's the logo with all the the icons for this year. That looks really cool. Okay, now I need you to help me. Do you like this one or this one? What's on the back of that one? Back. What's on the other side of that one? There's nothing. Nothing? That one says the date with all the mazes on it. Yeah, it does. As a tabletop player, I was really excited about this. This is a, a dice rolling like tray. Put that down, you can roll your dice in there. Well, DJ, get campaign back yeah, DJ, get your campaign together. Nerds vs. Evil shout out right there. They have a Stranger Things candle. Work together. Work together. What does it smell like? Oh. Does it smell like? It smells like brimstone and hellfire. It smells like Halloween. Let me see. Smell. It smells like Halloween. It's it's like that October fall candle smell. It smells like something we would burn in our house 24/7. Yeah. Like. Well, I get stranger things. Not Halloween Horror Nights related, but this is a great shirt. I'm always on the lookout for the future, or for a future ex Mrs. Malcolm. Oh, uh, it's a little boo plushy. So look, this is like your aesthetic. Oh, look at that shirt. Gosh dang it. See? Look at the bow. The bow's cool. Lights up. It's the little boo pins. Look at these patches. Oh, those are cool. Those I don't know that you can't see them on there because the light. Yeah, those are really cool. And then look, you could get a, a little boo succulent. Uh, all right. Where's your pup right here? Right over there. That lady with the loading can. Yeah, yeah, that's the one right there. <laughs> Thank you. You got it, big man. You got it. All right, so let's check it's out the fun. Jurassic Cafe. Amber and I have never eaten here before. This is going to be a first time. Uh, uh, for us eating here, so. 
So they got lots of good stuff here. Amber's really not into any of these, but I think the cheesy bread and like some chicken sandwich action might be happening. It's pretty good to me. Okay, so I ended up getting the uh, chicken sandwich, which looks incredible. Uh, Amber got the uh, cheeseburger, and she also got a mojito with, this is a pretty cool bamboo that straw, cute? that's pretty neat. And then we got the uh, the cheesy bread bites with, there's some kind of special sauce with it. I don't know what the sauce is, but we'll try it. And then we got a, uh, it's like a fossil cake. There's some, you can see bone. there's some, yeah, there's bone candies in there. So we're gonna dig in, see what we think about this. I almost think this is like that, um, like that Italian dipping sauce, you know what I mean? It's pesto. Pesto, yeah. It's pesto. Mm, that is really good. You just double dip. I'm gonna definitely put some tapatio on this uh, chicken sandwich, spicing it up a little bit. Some people like to try their food before they enhance it, but not me. I already know. I'm gonna enhance this bad boy. Ooh. That's good. You don't like the bell peppers on yours? I like the bell peppers. Oh, oh dude, yeah. I, I like it again. That bell pepper is like really bringing up some serious flavor. She not really into yours? It's just a burger, there's not really anything special about it. The special sauce that's supposed to come on it is probably what's it's, supposed to make it special. But it's, it's imported from Isla Nublar. Huh? That's Isla Nublar meat. That's why. It's the only place you can get it in the world. Mine might have it. Sounds like you're making that up. Nope, it's real. Back check. Okay, so we're about to dig in to our our fossil cake here. I don't know what that is. Is that shrimp? What is that? I don't know what that is. Is that a strawberry? It's a mosquito in amber. Shut up. I swear to God, look. Well. <laughs> Just throw it at me. Why did you put it back in there? Because you have to have the full effect. It's a, it's a right. mosquito. Is it a real mosquito? Like we're about to eat bugs? I highly doubt it's a real mosquito. I'm just saying, maybe it is. They can it come is. to our house and collect all the mosquitoes they want. I know, right? Let me see it. Let, let me see it. That's Let's a mosquito. <laughs> You can't see it on camera. It's in there, look. It's. Hold on, you can't see this on okay, camera. Okay, listen. Why are you putting your fingers in the food? <laughs> Can you guys tell that that's a mosquito? I'm looking through the lens and I can't tell that it's a mosquito. Oh, it's a picture of, okay. It's like one of those edible. Print yeah, it's printout. like an edible printout of it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's like a picture that they printed on there. So as far as our Jurassic Cafe experience, I liked it. Amber wasn't really a fan. But hey, teach his own. Okay. It's not that I disliked it. I just think that the burger, probably without the special sauce, which I won't eat because it's mayo-based, it's not anything special. That's all. It wasn't bad. It wasn't a wow. My chicken sandwich was good. Fries were good. I and thought the dessert was good. Sauce. Yep, the, the dessert sauce. was good. So, 50-50, um, I the guess on that one. The mojito was good. Mojito was good. <laughs> I don't know who Hovo is. Oh, Hovo. Hovo. We're here for the past member appreciation day event where we get a special daytime tour a Stranger Things maze. I'm so excited. Around 
finally here again. Mm. And a crippin' officer at Nest. There's fog yeah. pumping through. Pouring out, 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 out of the building. Oh, no. Okay, guys. So, our thoughts on what we got to see. It was, um, I don't know if because there was no scare actors in there. It was underwhelming. It was, it was underwhelming, yeah. It was cool to see some of the, the effects, like the practical stuff that they used in the maze. Um, but ultimately... It's a lot of the same, to be honest with you, it's a lot of the same regurgitated things. They used the stairwell from the Haunting of Hill House maze. Almost that entire room was almost exactly the same except for the wallpaper. Right. Um, the same chair that they used in the weekend maze where they're, they're probably going to have 13. Oh yeah. Or 11, 11 not 13. 13? Okay, fix that. Keeping that uh, in. No, Keeping it no, in. No, shut up. Lucky number 13. Probably the same chair where they're going to have 11 sitting in. Yeah. Um, um, a lot of generic, it's a lot of generic hallways. I, there was only one for sure black hallway. No, two. There was two black One in the hallways, middle, yeah. one at the end. It was underwhelming because you started to go into the ball and then all of a sudden you It just ends. Out. Yeah. Maybe uh, there's more to it and we just didn't see it. Like they sent us a different way. No. <laughs> no. Wishful thinking. We haven't even made it to the event yet and I'm already disappointed. I wasn't. I, I liked it. I, I don't think it was... Uh, worth coming all the way out here to do. We drove very far to do this. And uh, it was neat to go through the maze with the lights on. Uh, but ultimately... This is something that your brother didn't put on. That would something that the Halloween guy can make even better. Yeah, I, I thought it would have been cool. Maybe I'm being partially credible. I think it would have been cool if we had like a guided tour where they could have given us some like inside in some of it and other than we just like walked through. It was over super quick. Yeah, so, I thought it was going to be a guided tour. I did too, but hey, you live and learn. So, yeah. We'll be back next week. We'll be back next week for Halloween Horror Nights. We'll actually see it in its, in its full glory. Yeah. Hopefully the characters make it. By the way, it was cool. Uh, we did get to see Vecna, that was cool. Yeah, they did have Vecna. Had yeah. one scare actor in there, but it was the same generic universal scare where there was a. Uh, I like those scares. We'll see you real soon.